you know, getting to know the coaches a little bit more. Um, and, you know, with all the guys that are coming to visit, you know, that we can try and do some recruiting too. So, um, yeah, it's going to be a fun weekend. How different is it to camp, and I'm sorry if you've been asked this already, but how, how different is it to camp as a commit as opposed to sign someone trying to earn Ohio State detention or earn an offer? Um, it's like a practice, honestly. It's not really like trying to get exposure. It's like really just working on, you know, what you're doing and how the coach wants you to do it. Yeah. So they're, they, they're kind of, you know, they hold you to a higher standard because they know that you're, you're going to be coming here in the next year. So um, and Coach Fry, you know, he does that. Uh, you know, he, he pushed us today and he showed us how he really coaches and I like that because I got a little taste of it. What kinds of things did he kind of push you most on today? Um, you know, just being really precise because, he, you know, he's really uh, exact about what he what he wants done and how he wants it done. So, um, you know, when he was, you know, just going through the drills, you know, he really wanted us to do it the correct way. Yeah. And he taught us how to do it, you know, if we messed up. So it was good. And getting to know, I mean, how's your relationship with him? How is it kind of working with him today? Did it feel like almost like, you know, going into the future and seeing what it would be like to work with Justin Fry and, Ian and stuff like that? Or? Yeah, for sure. Um, like, you know, cause I, didn't, I didn't camp here last year. So, you know, getting back with him, you know, uh, and just seeing, you know, what he does and, you know, how I do stuff, you know, we could really just uh, learn from each other almost and, you know, just get better, you know, while camping with each other. What's the biggest nugget, individual thing that you're going to take from this camp you learned? Um, I would say, uh, you know, how he wants us to step, our steps and stuff, you know, because coming from a high school coach, that wants you to do stuff a certain way to college, you know, a really high level college coach is very different. So um, the way I'm stepping and stuff, it really, he gave me a lot of good pointers. Um, so now I can just take that and, you know, dominate this fall with it. Your, your feet are something that stands out on film. Is that something you see as a strength of your game, your ability to move your feet through blocks and those types of things? Yeah, for sure. Um, you know, being my size, a lot of guys really can't move their feet like that. So, um, you know, and obviously you win with your feet so you gotta have good feet to be able to block, you know, really fast, good D linemen. So it's also about finishing blocks too, and, and your aggression stands out in that regard. Just, uh, you, I guess you can kind of seem like more of a reserve guy in these interviews. How, how do you do you see a difference in the way you act on the field, being that like, you know, playing with that aggression, and then how you are off? The field? Yeah, um, you gotta. It's not really, uh, you know, you gotta just have that balance. Um, you know, off the field, you gotta be a good young man. Um, you know, yes sir, no sir, respect, you know, to guys. And, uh, you know, on the field, you gotta be a dog, you know, so you just gotta have that switch, that balance. Um, you just gotta know where you're at, you know, what's what's the attitude that's appropriate. You know, you don't wanna be, you know, a butthole to people off the field. <laughs> and then you wanna, you know, so that's why you wanna just always have that balance and, you know, be a good person. When do you flip that switch before games and how do you do it? Um, I would say probably once, you know, we get in the locker room, you know, everybody's, you know, just just really getting locked in, you know, just focusing on what's in front of them. You know, that's how I, that's how I do it. I kind of, uh, you know, my, co my coach really told me to stay at where my feet at. So wherever I'm at in that moment is how I'm thinking and what I'm trying to, you know, get done and, you know, that whatever task is in front of me. Do you have a go-to hype-up song? Um... I would say, but I don't think they're appropriate. So <laughs> I don't want to say it. Who's so. it by? Uh, it's by a lot of people. I like DMX. I listen to DMX before games a lot. All right. Uh, um, so, yeah. Respect. You're going to give the Armstrongs grief for not being here? Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, man. They, I don't know why they didn't throw us a date to come. So, me and Ian, it was like we just had to you know, get one in before the official visit. We might try and get up back out here Monday. Um, after the visit, so yeah. Any goals for your final season?